Yo, what's going on, guys? This is Mickey CTX, and welcome, welcome, welcome. Well, welcome back. I've been fucking uh, hiatus for quite a bit on commentaries, haven't I? Well, for you guys that, of course, have been keeping up with my uh, commentaries and everything that's been going on this YouTube channel, <clears throat> the reason why I've been uh, been out really is because I've been having this big project of uh, installing this whole wood thing wood thing <laughs> wood floor for my uh, my folks which actually uh took about a week and a half and i've been really i really haven't had all my utensils and my my tools for me to make commentaries because everything was just scattered everywhere and today is actually today uh well not today yesterday was actually the first day that i could actually see my microphone back and my computer back in place and and everything's back to normal and i'm glad that uh, everything got put up you know because uh it's just the way it should be whenever you're trying to do some YouTube videos, right? But anyways, um, I really haven't even been playing Call of Duty uh, or much of my PlayStation 4 as much as I would like to. Today is probably the first day uh, that I was able to play uh, more than one game or two at, at, at most. Uh, I've been playing for about an hour and a half, and that's a lot for me for, because I just um, I haven't really been doing much. So right now you're actually watching a PlayStation 4 Call of Duty game of ghost and uh, it's a kind of different the way I've been I, I'm used to me recording through my Elgato and I'm used to it rendering on my computer so basically the way I've been doing it is a new way I'm gonna make a video about it for you guys that don't know how to record on your PlayStation 4 uh, you basically got to do it another way and I'm not really used to it yet uh, I'm trying to record and I'm, it, it just takes a little too long some, sometimes to do all this stuff but uh, back to the commentary of the the house I, I showed you guys the house tour the vlog and I made a video the day before that uh, the reason I made that vlog was because a lot of you people people <laughs> a lot of you people actually sounded racist didn't it a lot of you fuckers <laughs> wanted to oh fuckers is better Mickey no but a lot of you guys wanted to uh, see the house and do like a house tour and uh, it was more like the third day after it started installing my floor and a lot of you guys liked the uh, the commentary and glad you guys did uh, it was it's like I said it's a lot of work and my folks thank God aren't even here they're not even back yet they're actually gonna be back on Tuesday uh, giving me another day to put everything up because actually everything's not up back and I uh, didn't finish so, uh, one room which was probably the most important room uh, but it's uh, because I didn't really have a choice they uh, the people that made the floor they decided to try to finish faster and I didn't know that they were gonna advance to that room so I didn't get to paint it now I gotta be extra careful on how I paint uh, the uh, the game room because it's a pretty big room it's like the size of the living room so it's a pretty big uh, thing to do especially when you do like a white uh, a ceiling and like another tone on the bottom anyways I'm not gonna get too like complicated on how I'm gonna paint things like that but that is what I'm gonna be doing uh, today hopefully tonight uh, I just ended up eating right now and uh, wanted to make commentary to you know update you guys and how everything is and respond to one of you uh, I had an email from you guys which was pretty interesting I think because uh, I've done the same thing, but it wasn't uh, how you guys think it did. It is, anyways. So uh, before I do the commentary, I want to thank you guys for sticking by. I know I haven't really been posting uh, commentaries and a lot of the things that you guys like to see my channel in. And I really uh, appreciate you guys asking me how the floor is. That you know, uh, you know, to, for me to re uh, record the reactions for my folks. And uh, and I'm gonna try to record it and put it on this channel because I think it's a special moment, and I wouldn't mind uh, sh sharing it with you guys. Uh, if of course my folks, because uh, they hate being in front of cameras. And as a matter of fact, I hate it too. I'm, uh, whenever I make these vlogs and things like that, I don't think I'm like, oh my god, I'm having such a good time. Like you know, girls, they love to be on camera. I, I hate it. I just hate being in front of camera. And I uh, hate being, I don't even do selfies. Fuck selfies. I, I like like watching them. I like seeing girls do it. But I don't I do not do selfies. I don't like to be in photos that much. It's not because I think I'm ugly or anything. I just don't like to do it. But uh, my folks, as far as they, I don't know how they're going to take it. So, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and read the uh, email that I got today. I wasn't today. I, when was it? It was a week ago. Over a week ago. And it says, speaking hypothetically, Mickey, is it okay to piss on people while they are passed out? Say it's just hypothetically, I pissed on my friend and his booty buddy, who uh, I also fucked around with uh, over a year ago, and uh, they were both passed out at a party. Is this a lesson for them not to be fucking passing out at a rager, like a kind of just a hilarious drunken prank, or was I in the wrong of doing this? Again, this is purely hypothetical. On a lighter note, what is the best football game you went to while attending your university? 
Alright, so as I'm sliding back, I don't know if you guys can hear that. I'm trying to slide back into the mic because I'm just sliding backwards right now. I feel like I'm ice skating like Disney on ice right now. But anyways, you're asking me hypothetically, and I don't know if you really are talking hypothetically, but man, that story you just told me, the hypothetical version of you, sounds like a real motherfucker. I mean, granted to you, I have urinated on a friend's girlfriend before, but I was sleepwalking, bro, and I had zero control over my body and my bladder. Which, of course, makes it sort of okay. But it sounds like you consciously and, of course, you knew what you were doing when you walked over. You wa you whipped out your glory stick and you deuced the daylights out of them. And uh, that's kind of knowing that you did it. But is that a prank? It's as much as a prank as just walking up to a random guy on the street and just putting out your fucking nutsack over his body and yelling, PRANK! Although I can see that uh, being a headlight right now and any kind of Google search I do, uh, bro just fucking pulls out his dick and thinks it's a prank and he gets his ass beat up by some big fucking 6'10 linebacker for the Dallas Cowboys. Uh, yeah, I don't really want to hear that. I think that's a really a prank. But here's the thing. While brutally dickish, it also depends where the hypothetical you aim to piss. I would be fine with this. I mean... You doing it not happening to me, of course. If you just pissed on your friend and you aimed at his crotch, so he thought he pissed himself when he woke up or something like that. Uh, but if you hypothetically just, you know, I'm talking about you, uh, you hosed him down, both of them in their face, that's kind of messed up, and that's on the messed up side. But uh, that's really what I see you doing, uh, your hypothetical you. I think it's fucked up. Anyone that would do that at a party, because you're in stinks, bro, and this is not you know, air it, okay, you cannot just put fucking deodorant on that shit, because stress stinks and air it works, you remember that commercial, dude, anyways, uh, but on the lighter note, uh, the most memorable game I have ever gone at my university, oh, it wasn't even my university, actually, it was, uh, when I went to Austin, and it was, uh, University of Texas versus, of course, uh, Texas Tech, and those fuckers, man, holy shit, I mean, you want to hear a rival, uh, it's between those two teams, and of course, the Aggies versus the, of course, if you guys don't know too much about the college football, it is the Texas Aggies, a and uh, versus uh, UT, those games are always the most hyped up games I've, I could ever go to, and uh, I can nearly have a good time, I'm, I'm, since I don't go to either one, I have a good time of just going to the game period it's a lot of fun and i highly recommend you guys if you ever guys are ever guys or girls if you guys are ever here in texas and you guys have a chance to go to a, a college game like that go for it even though a&m and and ut doesn't play anymore but you could always go to a texas tech and a ut game or some other aggie game and it's gonna be a lot of fun even though they might lose it's all good you get to get fucked up and have a great time doing it so anyways, hopefully you guys uh, enjoyed this video and the gameplay. Uh, I'm trying to get used to this uh, format of doing, uh, uh, recording my uh, games right now on PlayStation 4. I'm, I think I, I don't think I read that they're going to be fixing this on one of the patches that you're able to uh, record straight and instead of it going on Facebook and recording it through your computer and this this and that you're gonna be able to just straight up getting from your PlayStation 4 but I don't know when that's gonna be because uh, apparently Xbox one right right from the box you'll be able to record uh, your gameplay and upload it and things like that and put it to your computer uh, and another thing um, no what was that it was the fact that you could actually use your game capture card and actually record from the box that's what I meant and uh, that's gonna be really exciting because I don't I don't like doing it this way. I like my capture card, and I don't care if you can record 15 minutes of gameplay. My Elgato is way better than any capture card they have because it's always recording, even when I don't know it's recording. And it doesn't just record 15 minutes. It records like three hours or something like that. And I could go back really far and just edit what I want. Don't have to upload it and then download it and upload it again so I could download it again. And blah, blah, blah. it's just a lot of confusion. So hopefully PlayStation 4 uh, fixes that because I don't want to see it just crumble on that aspect because uh, people really want to do the YouTube on PlayStation 4 and take it more serious, but it's going to be hard doing it this way, um, unless you, of course, you're White Boy 7th Street, which, of course, then you already have about 2 million subscribers on those, but uh, the ones that are trying to do PlayStation 4 commentary is going to be a little hard, uh, and, of course, in a few days, Xbox One's going to come out, and I already paid it off, so I'm going to be going out there and picking it up, I'm going to be doing a commentary on, uh, of course, on the game, I mean, on the console, and, of course, a comparison on both, which is going to be a really good time. Uh, because I played on, I haven't really played too much of PlayStation 4, but by then, I guarantee, because I'm going to be done with this house project by the day, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to uh, do a comparison video on both 
consoles. Probably, hopefully, no later than Saturday, no later than Monday, around that time frame. So, uh, if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button for more daily content here on this channel. And, of course, if you like this video, I would really appreciate it if you leave a like. It helps my channel out every time you guys do that. And I love you guys when you do that. You guys get free cookies when you do that. And, uh, of course, next time, this is George Truly, Mickey, CTX, and I'm out.